News Picks, okay? News Picks. That's its name. It is a new social network. It bills itself as the anti Facebook. It doesn't sell your data to third parties, doesn't force news stories on you. Far from it. It is the anti Facebook. News Picks CEO is Ian Myers, and he's with me in New York this morning. Obvious question. <laughs> How do you make money? <laughs> well, we think there are plenty of great media companies that have been making money for centuries on the back of subscription. High quality content. Wait a subscription. Subscription. So you're going to start charging for your service? Yes. But not now? Not now. Right now, we're aggregating content from a variety of publishers. Okay, but it's high quality content? High quality content. So everything from the Wall Street Journal to the Washington Post, New York Times, some of the newer media businesses too, like Vox, Vice, BuzzFeed, those oh, guys are all there. But you decide what you feed to your people, right? Uh, yes, but it's based on what our community, what our audience likes. So if our audience picks a story, they start talking about it, they get really excited, then we'll show that to people. Okay. We're take uh, are you off and running already? Yes, yep, up since the beginning of this year. And at the moment it's free? Yes. I sign on, so to speak. Yep. Uh, you get my information, but you don't use it. No, we have no business model around selling data, collecting data. It's not what we're about. Okay, and at some point in the future, you start charging me. If you want to. If you think our content is valuable in the same way you think the Wall Street Journal content is valuable, the same way you think the Times content is valuable, you'll pay us for it. And we think that's a fair way to do it. And if I don't pay, you kick me off. Well, you still get the free side. So there's still a whole aspect of the platform, which I think is really great, where you can still discover the news, have fun, engage with the community. But if you want the deeper content, that's where we're going to make money. I, I should tell everyone that Rupert Murdoch, who runs the Fox uh, Empire, he has a stake in your company, I believe. Yes, that's I, correct. I, I think it's very forward looking. I mean, obviously, there's something that needs to change for traditional media and having an interest in businesses that are digital first, that are exciting, that have a social aspect, that are pulling together all the things consumers want when they look for a new media source is a really impressive thing. If you are the anti Facebook, what's Facebook doing wrong? Well, I think Facebook is trying to do too many things for too many different people. I mean, they, they started out as a social network and then they became social media. And to be honest with you, I think if Facebook's had its way, there would be no internet. There would just be Facebook. No email, just Facebook. No anything, mm. just Facebook. And I think that's where they went wrong. And I don't think people are going to leave Facebook. I think they're going to spend a lot less time there after all these things came out about Cambridge Analytica for the things that Facebook does do wrong. Sure. So that's news. People are leaving. They're coming to us for that kind of content. News picks. Is that two words? News picks? Just one word. News picks. News picks. Mm -hmm. Thanks for joining us, sir. We appreciate it. My pleasure. Very good idea, young man. Thanks. Not yes. bad. All right. Thank you.